all right good evening good afternoon good morning and welcome to the stream how are we doing on word john stream level three already wow wow that's awesome oh oh there's a lot of good possibilities in there oh no uh, no can you no you can't do that you could no i'm at a loss i want to type in district but that wouldn't work Anyways, good morning, everyone. How are we doing? Let's see how we're doing here score-wise. All right. Way to go, guys. Nice work. All right, let's uh, switch over to here. So we're continuing on with our uh, Freestar Ranger story arc with Starfield. And uh, I, th I think it's going okay. We had our first run in with um, some, uh, uh, I thought they were mercenaries, but they're, I, I think they're gonna be like uh, an elitist group or something like that. I don't know. Let me just, uh, I'm checking some stuff here real quick. Um, I think everything's okay, so we can just hop into the game here. As all as always, my uh, mod list is uh, available. Um, star field. There it goes. Oh, that was weird. All right, locking the mouse. Continuing with Clark Griswold. How is my general feel of Starfield? You know, that's the bad thing with the game, right? You get hype from the group or people that really look forward to it. Um, when they first announced Starfield, I wasn't excited about it because the last game I played that I had a lot of fun with was Fallout 4 from Bethesda. Fallout 76, I played the beta, it was full of bugs. I had so much fun with it but it seemed like the mentality, they kept adding stuff and not fixing the bug. So it, it completely turned me off. And then they tried to do the whole uh, battle royale thing in competition with, uh, um, you know, PUBG and uh, Fortnite and all those things. And I was thinking, you guys are losing focus on your game, you know? So before you roll out any DLC, fix your problems, you know? And then of course, when you roll out DS DLC, if the break something, fix it, you know? So it seems like they were just trying to add more and more content to keep people coming and not fixing all the problems. So far, I have had probably a handful of crashes. Um, there's some annoyances, like when you go to talk with people, they're talking to the wall instead of facing you. So uh, I don't think that really bothers me that much. Um, the, the first hot fix that they put out fix some bugs that I didn't come across. So it was very interesting how uh, how that worked out. So overall, um, I'm enjoying the game. There's DLC coming next year for it. And also I, I think the official modding tools will be available. So all the mods that are coming out right now, people are just finding a way how to make changes with what, the, what tools they have at their disposal. All right, so we, whoa, why is my gun out? I'm scared. That we have to dress up for these things. It's exhausting. Yes, exhausting. Uh. Uh. All right, where's my ship? Is that my ship over there? Why am I over here? Oh, I must have, oh, I went to trade services. Oh, okay. I thought my ship was stolen. There's my boat. Okay. 
she said she um, someone else. So weight's looking good. Um, we have weapons. I don't have any ammo from the drum beat. That takes uh, 11 millimeter. Let's go see if we can buy some. I don't have a whole lot of cash. I got two suits. Oh, 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 that's right. They almost look almost. Well, I guess they don't look exactly the same. All right. All right. So I need to sell some Sometimes stuff. So let's go in here. Yeah, okay, no time to talk. Uh, shepherds, they sell all sorts of stuff, but let's go to Roland's Arm. There's supposed to be another uh, gun place somewhere. Let's go in here, talk to her. I don't do outlaws. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Okay, but if you start shooting up the town. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I promise. So I want to sell. She's got some cash. I wish to sell. I'm confused, wait a minute. Sell. Oh, she won't. Oh, 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 that's a bummer. All right, so I don't have any. Okay, so. Okay. So the 11 millimeter is what I need. I don't want to sell. Buy, buy ammo. 11. Does it matter? Good God, that's a lot of money. I'm gonna buy, okay, let's just buy a few to make sure that works for this gun. No, nope, wrong gun. Nope, still, oh, it does. All right, so, so I, I wonder if ammo has a, uh, oh, sorry, lady, not holding you up. You ask me, traveling, you see him all right. So, there's 11 millimeter caseless, and then there's other stuff too. I wonder if it matters. 4,000. I'm gonna buy it all. All right. All right. Um, now, let's go over to this dude. Try to recoup some of our funds. Oh, there he is. Take a look around. It's a good bet I've got something. No, no, I, it, it's a it's a fine place you have here, sir. Here. I get all kinds in here. Rangers, traders, locals, tourists. They all come to me for supplies. You seem tired. <sighs> Exhausted, more like. I it's see. It's just me running things here. Oh. Thanks for some real long work days. Of course, that's in addition to the special orders, trade contracts, and supply arrangements that I deal with on a daily basis. I also work with the Council of Governors, the Trade Authority, the Freestar wow. Rangers, you name it. Oh, I'm a ranger. It's like I'm providing a service to the city while trying to run a business. So yeah, I don't get a lot of sleep. Dude. All right, let's see what you got for sale. Take a gander. Thanks. I would like to actually sell you some stuff if you don't mind. Um, oh good, he's gonna buy. He's got some money. Um, we're gonna get rid of the sturdy mining suit. Try to get our weight back. Now. It's a trade-off here, but that just looks dorky. I don't want to wear that thing. Oh, all right. So. There's a little bit of mass here. So we have utility outfit. Soldier. I'm going to get rid of the utility ranger. Oh, so the first soldier outfit. That's that's the guys, the first soldier. I don't want to wear that. I'll probably get in trouble. So I get faster reloads with uh, with this one. So we're going to keep that. I'm going to sell him all of my inferno mines I'm going to keep my frag mines. I have 12 med packs. Sweet. Why is my free star deputy badge considered trash? I don't like that. Not at all. All right, so we are reloaded and ready to go. Is that a wind indicator? All right. Whew. 
So we're supposed to, whoa, look at all this stuff. Oh, the special sauce order. Um, ooh, Mantis, I know what that is. You know, I'm probably gonna go do that one. Yeah, let's go do that one. After her, um, let's do this one. Special thought. This is Freestar Collective Space. Hold while we scan your ship. Okie dokie. You'd think that since I'm Freestar, they, they wouldn't have need. to. Enjoy neon. All right, thank you. Not really looking forward to it. Not really. Not at all. Somebody in chat yesterday said it was in New Atlantis, but it said neon, so I thought that maybe there was a neon establishment. Oh well. do is try to get in and out because I've been here before and just passing by a few things I picked up so many side quests so yeah so I just want to oh I need oh I'm I am not completely full of ammo here am I all right hang on so need more bullets for that really low on that That's right, come right off my ship. I'm doing reloads here. All right. I gotta pick up a crate of chunk sauce or something like that. Wait, do I have any levels? I have no levels, all right. So the main, the main, the main playthrough is for the free star. It doesn't mean I don't want to do any side quests. Don't move, Nesha. What the hell is this about? Cut the act. Snippers picked up the Aurora you're carrying. The uh, second you step through. All right, get up slowly and turn around. Try to run, and we open fire. Bummer. Snippers got him. for a job I didn't want to apply for a job oh sounds like she's trying getting all sorts of chatter uh, um go this way chunks hey welcome to chunks please choose your chunks wow thanks for choosing chunks uh, Which I'm, chunks would you like today? I'd like to pick up special sauce chunks for new homestead, please. Huh? I thought that was a joke at first. Nope. Yep. Yeah, here you are. Let me get that for you. It's amazing how popular this stuff is on Titan. You'd think they just drank it over there. Ooh. Maybe they do. All right. What did I pick up while I was here? Talk to Clover. Use hand scanner. Okay. Um. Loose ends. I don't want to do any of that. All right. So let's um. Oops. Let's return to Luther. Land at Homestead. And if they're having brownouts again, I'm gonna have to talk to him about their maintenance. Hey guys, carry on. Oh, last time I was here, it was, it was nighttime.
So, does this tell me how much cash I have? I do. I have 36,000 credits. All right. Feel free to look around, but don't touch. All right. I got to deliver something to Luther. Chung special sauce, special delivery. Hey, Luther. Hey, good to see you again. About that sauce. Yeah, I got it for you. Hell yeah, you came through. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's the stuff, all right. Enough for the customers with a little left over for yours truly. Uh-oh. Mm, thanks. <laughs> that was funny, I have to admit. All right, let's get back on track here. Um. Go here. So we have to figure out where the stolen ship came from. It was Mayday. a hope. Mayday, this is Free Star Ranger Nia Kalu. If We're anyone is hearing this, systems failing. Need help. I repeat, right. need help. Where are you? Ship. You've entered Free Star Collective Space. Maintain your current course while we scan for contraband. I missed the beginning of the stream. Is this a restart? Right, yeah, I'm doing, it. um... Welcome to Hope Town. Thanks. Wait, there was a... Oh, is it this one? All right, here we go. Um, yeah, I'm doing a, a faction per uh, tune. So this is a chapter two. Okay, board. This is uh, for Freestar Rangers. And any, any other side quest. Hello? I think I'm answering your distress call. Whoa. All right. Are you over there? Oh, geez. Coming. Fell, fell all the way through. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, geez. Hello? Whoa. Hey. Please tell me you're here to help. Not to try and steal my ship. Uh, I'm, I'm here to help. Um, show badge. The marshal sent me to find you. I need your help. I did? He did? Whoa, wait a minute. I am Ranger Deputy Clark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. The marshal didn't actually send me. Wait a minute. I'm confused. Hang on. Who is this? You are. Yeah, I don't know who you are. Please tell me you're here. To All right. I wasn't specifically sent by the marshal, but, uh... Welcome aboard, deputy. Sorry if I can't give you the grand tour just yet. Yeah, yeah. I was tracking a crew of outlaws that's been preying on merchant ships. Bastards got the drop on me. I ran them off, but they got a few good hits in. As you can see, I ain't in much shape to make repairs. Well, here, I, um... I'll see if I can get it to fly again. Just patch her up enough to get to Hope Town. The rest can get fixed up there. Hope Town. Okay. No, I don't need a. Thanks. Yeah. I owe you one. No problem. So I got to repair the ship. Oh, also, you got all kinds of problems here. Sure hope you don't need a dock while I do this and you die or something. That was terrible. So let's go in here. And. Uh, um, oh, in there. Wow. Nice layout for a ship. Oh, that thing's all sparkly. Alright, so, repair. Wow, that easy. You just throw a switch and it's repaired, huh? Nice. Um, something upstairs, it looks like. Ooh. Nothing in there. Bummer. Um, up and down. All right, so let's go up first. All right, let's go down first because I don't know what, what I'm doing. Wow. I never saw the outside of this ship for real, but nice. They got a big engine room section and Okay, I'm good at throwing switches, evidently. The best switcher thrower there is. Three stories. 
Yeah, so I finished the main story arc and the UC faction. Really good stuff so far. Um, nice desk. I'm gonna take a med pack if you don't mind. Kind of collecting them. Not really, but... Oh, all right, I gotta push this button here, look. Check it out. It's all fixed. Oh, geez. Um. Huh. Do, 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 do. Yeah. I don't think I like the multi tier ladder thing. Thanks. That should get me home. You're right. They were pretty beat up, so I don't think they got real far. But if they make it back to their hideout, I might never find them again. We can't let that happen. Okay. Just tell me where they're headed. I'll handle it. They look to be heading for Polvo's Moon Miatha. Good hunting. All right. So, I'm out of here, I guess. Uh, I have to go up, right? Uh, up, ladder. Whoa. Oh, right out loud. I don't know how to use ladders in this game. There was another really big ship. Oh, I need to undock. No, no, okay, station, not ship. Oh, there's a skill magazine, huh? Dang it. Okay, what is this? Volvo station. All right. So... Uh... Okay, those are done. First is time for to learn why the first mercenary come. Okay, so I thought she gave me to go hunt down. All right, well, it's not. It says the moon. That's it. Uh, redistributed here. Um, all right, where you at? Where you at? There you are. You know, and Shoot it. I guess I'll take it. Oh, I'm getting pounded on by the by his chums. Oh, all right. I'll do it. There we go. There we go. All right. Sorry, I was having a little problem here. You know. Day, mister. I was about 
about to die. for that. I got really messed up there. I'll take the credit, uranium. I think I got hung up on trying to loot the first guy I took out and well, you know, that's what happens. Things are getting fixed. So let's wait for everything to get fixed. Um, if I do inventory for the ship, I'm looking for, so I don't have any more ship's parts. Yikes. All right, I need to, I need to get some of those. It's gonna be important. star got a badge and that's it you're clear to land at hometown cool all right well i guess uh i guess i'm gonna do it there's hopetown let's get a science outpost two of them so a little run in with outlaws almost did me in Went through all my ship's parts. All right. Hopefully this is a nice civil place and I don't have to shoot anyone. Let's see what I want to directly. So I, I want to focus on, I need to progress, of course. And I'm trying to think about being a free star, kind of like a, a, a sheriff. But at the same time, I think I want to focus on one kind of weaponry, I think, also on my ship. Now, is there, is there a reason why these flash versus these not flash? Oh, because, oh, oh, I see. I've met the requirements. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. Um, persuasion. Okay, I gotta do that successfully. I, I wanna raise my health, though. That's, yep. Cool. All right. Um, I guess we're going this way. All right. Ooh, do I got any stuff to sell? I don't think so. I was just in battle, right? Yeah. Um. There I go. Hi there. I don't want to hear any complaints. Okay. Oh, same as usual. Except now all she does is goes on and on about how her youngest has made it and tells everyone. Excuse me. That's the Hope Tech. Right. Keep an eye on your valuables. 
if you can't protect your own, you don't belong here. Hey, it's your cousin who got just a way. That's not a very good policy, you know? Hey, there she is. You made it. Yes. Those outlaws didn't give you too much trouble, I trust? Nah. Well, a little bit. They put up a fight, but I got him in the end. I'm sure they didn't want to die any more than you did. It's a pointless and stupid waste of life. Sure is. They brought it on themselves. They did. You've got good timing. A courier just came in from Aquila. The marshal sends his regards along with a briefing on your case. I was surprised as hell to learn about the starship theft. Nobody said a word to me about it. Uh, anyway, Mr. Hope can see us whenever you're ready. If you need to take a little time first, feel free. Uh, nobody reported the theft? No, and I can't get answers as to why not. I'm sure Mr. Hope has his reasons. All right. I'd like to take a look around. I want to find some place where I can buy some stuff. Sure. I'll be right here when you want to head up. You? Is there... Um, oh, so this is more of a, 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 not a town, but whoa. That's got a lot of gas tanks on it, but that's a long range hauler. Um, so this is an office building. It says sales, but I think that's for, I, God, that's rude. Um, I don't think they're going to have like any sort of a store because this ain't a town. It's just a. Uh... Hey, how you doing, B Mac? We'd be dust except for the factory. Best defense. Is this a security office? Yes. What? No, they sell stuff. Oh. Slightly increase the range and accuracy of combat tech weapons. I don't know what those are, but. Is this free? Can I take that? Thank you. <clears throat> um. Yes. All right. So I'm almost out of ammo on my uh, old reliable here. I need to get some 6.5 millimeter ammo. You here for commerce or another board tourist? No. Some rules. If there's one place, there's some law and order in this town. It's here. Don't even think about stealing anything. No haggling. The price is the price. Okay. And but the... might be some other rules. Don't be an ass. Whoa, language, mister. Uh, good rules. I can respect that. Then we won't have any problems. If you need weapons, the best defense is the only place in town. So this is a town. You this place is a dump, but the hardware isn't. Oh. Lots of customers pass through. We got something for everyone. All right, let's see what you... Why do you have some serious... Mer I don't want to ask that question. How's living in Hopetown? There ain't any handouts here. You need to protect what's yours. But if you do, you can be your own person. I'll take that over being a corporate drone any day of the week. Ah, ah, I see his angle here. Music to my ears. All right. So I'm looking for ammo. And I'm looking for... So, let's see here. Um, can I drill down on the specifics? Oh, I don't want to. No, no, no. Hang on. So I need 6.5 millimeter, but there's an array and CT. I don't know what the difference is. Except for one's more expensive than the other. Oh, interesting. All right, so the MI array, I see more bullets on it versus. All right, hang on, hang on. I'll be right with you, sir. <clears throat> so my Maelstrom says 6.5 millimeter. I have 37 rounds of something. So let's buy. You ready to do some business? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Yes. Let's buy um, the array. Let's buy a couple rounds, like 20. And interesting. So okay. that, that didn't Hello. go up. 
Now it used to be in in Fallout you could get different ammo like armor piercing and whatnot, and you could switch between Only the different. Place you can get a weapon in town. So the the array does not work on this. Maybe that's a, oh oh maybe that's the receiver or something like that. Oh, I get it. I get it. Okay, so I just bought ammo I can't use yet. Hello. It's the right stuff. You ready to do some business? Yeah, yeah. Hopefully I... something catches your eye. Shut up. So we just want the regular CT, I guess. Whoa. That's a ticket. All right. Oh, wait. And this uses... 7.5 millimeter. Hope's the best thing that's happened to us. You ready to do some business? Yeah. What are you looking for? Uh, I need bullets. That says array though. All right, let's um. I don't think. I think we confirmed that if it has something after it, it's for a, a certain kind of receiver. Yeah. See. That's what I thought. All right. Well, um, let's continue on our investigation. I don't think I have to shoot anyone in an office. So, all right. I got some bullets. How's it going? You ready to head upstairs? Yeah, let's head upstairs. Yep. His office is upstairs. He's in a meeting, but it should be wrapping up. Come on. All right. I'm guessing the marshal already told you this, but I'll say it anyway. All right. Ron Hope isn't just the founder and president of Hope Tech. He's on the He's council. The council of governors. Yeah, I know. The council oversees the Free Star Rangers. All right. So don't rile him up. I've spent a long time trying to build a good relationship with Hope. <laughs> he comes on a little strong, but there's a lot to admire. Oh, she's a fast him. walker. Everything you see around you, he built. Pretty much everyone in this town owes him for their livelihood. Right. Can't begin to imagine the kind of pressure that must put on someone. No. Nope. All I'm saying is, try to show a little respect. I will. Who are you? We ran out of tungsten. You ever check out the prices at Trident? No. Goodbye, like a piece of home All the way up. All right. Is it just me, or does every executive in the settled systems have an office on the top floor? I, I don't know. Uh, I guess being above everyone makes them feel like they're, well above everyone the marshals is all the way at the top of the rock so you know think big office tall i don't know as for parts we could try outsourcing do a contract with scavengers maybe but that's a decision that's got to be made upstairs. Hmm. Well, talk to Elaine about the scavengers. It's not a bad idea, provided we get a good deal. And I don't mean a fair deal. I mean a good deal. Remember, it's not just our bottom line that matters. We're also responsible for the welfare of everyone in the factory. We look out for our people here, Burchett. That's a point of great personal pride. Huh. Um, excuse me, uh, Mr. Hope? Well, now, the Free Star Rangers. At last. <laughs> ah, damn. Good to see you. I think we're done here, Burchett. Yes, sir. This is the deputy I told you about. Hello. Splendid. Splendid. It's a noble calling. Free Star Ranger, mm, we certainly could use more of you. Uh, okay, he, he sounds like a, a true company man. It's not the bottom line, it's how much you put in my pocket or something like that. Let's get down to it, shall we? Trying. Time is money. I'm sure I don't have to tell you what an outrage it is to have a ship stolen right out of the factory oh, justice must be done 
and the sooner the better all right i like that i like that it will be i give you my word i'll do everything i can oh no 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 let's do this i found your stolen ship here that's good news i'll send my people over to bring it home you stuttered of course that doesn't mean your work is done oh i want the thief found all right and prosecuted to the full extent of the law i'm sure i don't need to remind you yes 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 God, why does everyone say that this guy's gonna be a, a bad guy in the end or something i don't give a damn about your position oh no no i'm aware of your position yes sir mr i hope you can count on me oh I want a fourth option. I'm glad we understand each other. <laughs> now, tell me that you've at least got a lead of some kind. Hmm? Um, yes, I do. I'm, I am not diplomatic. Your ship was delivered to a group of men were trying to acquire a farm. Of course I do, a group of mercenaries. Ah, oh, there we go. Well, I can't say I'm surprised. <laughs> Sadly, there's no lack of mercenaries in the settled systems. I suppose the chance to cut costs by stealing a ship was too good to pass up. Well, I'm not sure I can be much help, but I'll answer whatever questions I can. All right, time to drill him. Was there anything unique about the stolen ship? Ah, no, nothing at all. Oh, it was just a standard hope tech cargo hold. all right good he knew that but not at least. that it didn't have great value mind right you. right right hope tech build some of the most durable and reliable starships in the settled systems now you can bet my ships last twice as long as anything stroud <laughs> eckland makes all right did the thief had an inside help no anything why didn't you report the theft ah uh -huh. because i told them not to but if word got out, it would do irreparable harm to our image. Oh, I'm in. Wait a minute. Fierce competition with other starship manufacturers. Oh. Any sign of weakness could be fatal. Uh, what's more, every starship thief in the settled systems would would likely flock to Hope Town. Oh. And start planning right, the next. He's heist. got a point, but still. All right. Anyone see a thief? We questioned everyone who was in the building when it happened. And not one person seems to have seen anything at all. Really? Frankly, I think that's both highly unlikely and more than a little suspicious. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. However, I can't deny there are times when the hangar is empty, so it's not inconceivable the thief could have slipped in unseen. Hmm. So, I'm on the fence with this guy already. So, uh, the thief had inside help? know anything about that Ooh, sounds like i'm accusing him I, i'm i'm doing an investigation no holds bar here what nonsense we vet our people thoroughly here hope tech holds its employees to the very highest standards pissed him off nevertheless i suppose i could have cosette conduct a, a thorough yes. personnel yes. review there you go Rest assured. He's doing a lot of we CYH here, covering his tiny. That one of our people was an accomplice. I'll let you know. All right, I think we're done here. Very well. I need you to understand something, Deputy. Here it comes. This town. Oh. Is home to men, women, and okay. children. All right. Who depend on hope. Well, if you did something wrong, living, dude, I'm going down. I provide jobs that put food on their tables and a roof over their heads. It's a responsibility that I take very seriously. All right. If word gets out about the stolen ship, my investors will lose trust and my workers will pay the price. I can't allow that. All right. I understand your position. You can count on my discretion. I'm glad we understand one another. But also, I don't want the marshal getting mad. Sorry to interrupt, Mr. Hope. There's been a development. Not now, Cosette. I'm in the middle of something. But, sir, we have new information. I've just received a report that the stolen ship was seen landing at Neon just after the theft. Ooh. A breakthrough at last. Yes. Well, deputy, 
But it sounds like you'll be heading to Neon. I just came from there. Can get back to work. Remember what we discussed. Yeah, yeah. My people are depending on you. <sighs> yes, yes, hey, yes. Can I get a word? Oh, me? With her? Oh, yeah, oh. Alright. God, I'm being pulled in so many directions here. Off rollers. Nothing good ever comes from them. Shut up. That wasn't as helpful as it could have been. Still, at least you know where to pick up the trail. I do. Right at the last moment. I don't want to say this is a waste of time. I, I was hoping to learn more. Yeah, me too. Okay, good. So, guess you're headed for Neon. There's a ranger station there. Oh, Name's good. Jalen Price. All right. He's a little different than the rest of us. But a Neon's a different kind of place. All right. Uh, I don't need anyone's help. How is Neon different? What can you tell me about this ranger? He's what I'd call a pragmatist. Ah. He sees things for what they are. Gotcha. He's also well connected, which means a lot on Neon. You should listen to what he tells you. It'll keep you out of trouble. All right. He should be able to help you out. Well, we've both got work to do. It was good to meet you, deputy. Thanks again for helping me out up there. Anytime. Keep your eyes and ears open. I'm not sure we got the whole story here. Great. Uh, Actually, I'll be taking it easy for a couple of days. Need time to heal up. You and Helga. Then I need to get back up there and keep an eye out for more pirates. Right. I'm hoping to track one of their ships so I can find their hideout. Yes. Guess we could both use a little luck, huh? Keep your eyes open. Yeah. The question of who helped the starship thief is still an open one. Yep. Don't you worry. I'll keep an ear to the ground. Appreciate that Enjoy very much. Wow. Okay. Thanks for the money. I didn't know I was going to get paid just to investigate uh, at this point. All right. Shadows of Neon. Now, I've been there already, so I should. What I've been told is um, I should be able to do it right from here. Yeah. Huh. Neon explored. Go to Neon. Oh, okay. Here we go. Landing. Are you working toward that next technological theme? The Whoa, Marvel this was nice. Help you get there. Fill out an Put me right into a uh, into the town. Two Star Rangers. Hey, hey. Oh. Nice digs. Oh, you sleep here. Too. Oh, oh. He's got jail. All right. Hey, I don't care who you work for. You can't just. Oh, you're the rookie, aren't you? He was in the bar at the Raw, I think. Looks like him. Anyways, you must be Ranger Price. You weren't expect. You were expo. Oh. Not exactly, but I get a lot of unwanted visitors. Oh. Kind of comes with the territory here. All right, you must be Ranger Price. The one and only. Okay. Well, the marshal's message said you were following a lead about a stolen ship. Yep. Truth is. A lot of stolen goods flow through here. Ugh. But this city is real good at keeping its secrets, even from us. So you think I should give up? No, no. Hopefully I can count on your help. Yeah, that would be nice. You can count on my help if you play by the rules. This isn't Aquila City. The badge doesn't carry the same weight here. Uh-oh. The people who run this place aren't overly concerned about the law. Our job is to keep the peace Make sure the violence doesn't get out of hand. Oh, great. The last thing anyone around here wants is some hotshot deputy looking in every dark corner. So you're saying that you, oh, you just turn a, no, not a blind eye. You just kind of look the other way when it's not convenient, but not high level, but okay. I can't, I won't cause any trouble. Who runs this place? That would be Benjamin Bayou. 
He's out to squeeze every credit he can from the people of this city. He doesn't much care who gets hurt in the process. So he's a thug. He's also got a seat on the Council of Governors. Oh, nice. Which proves that if you've got enough credits, you can buy anything you want. Right. All right. All right, I won't cause any trouble. Good. Your stolen ship would have had to land at the spaceport. If it was right off the factory floor, it would have stood out. Okay. There's a guy I know, Billy Clayton, does maintenance work around the city and keeps an eye on ship traffic for me. I'll introduce you, but don't expect a favor. Even if it doesn't cause credits, nothing in neon is free. I I'm kind of broke. All right, aren't you worried about... Wait, what's going on? Was it your choice to be stationed here? Ooh, no, that sounds too personal. I don't want to get into that. Uh, aren't you worried that your badge makes you a target here? Nah, I've got friends in high places, so to speak. Uh -huh. I'm the son of a Ryujin Industries executive. Maybe you've heard of her. Name's Alexis Price. There's a sort of fragile piece here in Neon. Okay. It's better for everyone if the syndicates and the corporations coexist. Syndicates. With minimum friction. All right. Um, any advice? Are you sure this informant of yours is trustworthy? This is Neon. There are no guarantees. All right. Who I find trustworthy changes on a daily basis. Talk to him or don't. It's your call. All right, all right, 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 all right. Let's go talk to Billy. Come on. All right. Again, you got a very nice shiny office here. Oh, oh dang. It's on the move. how you volunteered to help out with the bank heist in Aquila City. That's interesting. But, oh, yeah. I read all the reports. I learned quickly that a neon staying informed and staying alive are closely linked. All right. What stood out to me was that you didn't lose a single hostage. No, I didn't. No wonder the marshal tried to recruit you right away. If he hadn't, it would have made him look like a fool having some random stranger step in and do the job he couldn't. Now, if someone tried to hold him... Oh, wait... He was in the middle of a conversation or a rant or something. But you understand that, don't you? That's why you just told me that you won't cause trouble. Keep that in mind. You'll fit right in. Okay. Tevin Anastas has run into some trouble. Word to the wise. You don't want a piece of that. Oh, I don't want to. Can you walk faster? My eavesdropping skill is like gone crazy. <sighs> Sleep great. Have those in Japan. Frankie's grab and grow. Go. Cool. Hey, Billy. You got a second? What? Oh, it's you. Oh, it's Didn't you. Scare. I thought you were one of Goodman's people. Uh oh. What does that mean? Far from it. Our new deputy here is working a case, and I thought you might be able to help. Take it away, rookie. All right. Thanks. Uh, hey, Billy. How you doing? What do you need? <laughs> Tell me what you know about a stolen Hope Tech ship and make it quick. Scab. No, I'm looking for a thief. Skilled enough to steal a ship off a factory. I stole a Hope Tech landed here recently. I need information on the pilot. Hmm. Well, it won't be number three. Let's do that one. Hmm. A stolen Hope Tech ship, huh? Well, here's the thing. Neon's got no end of ship jackers. I see them come and go every day. It's tough for a guy to remember one from the other. Know what I mean? People could be in danger. Don't make me persuade you. Came a thousand. 
I don't want to go right to the money option. I'm broke. Yeah, well, I'm one of them. Huh? I can help you. But right now, my life is in danger, and I haven't even done anything wrong. Oh, wait, Free what? Freestar Rangers are supposed to protect the innocent, right? All right, I'll try. All right, that's part of the job, yeah. Are you refusing to cooperate? Because that would have consequences. Where are you going with this? Uh, that's part of the job. Then you need to hear this. Okay. It's about my brother. Yeah. He died while still in debt to a syndicate loan shark by the name of Emmett Goodman. Uh-huh. Now, Goodman's coming after me to collect. He says if I don't pay up, I'm a dead man. Well, he's never going to get in problem. Uh, I'll talk to the loan shark, but you'd better make it worth my... No, I'm not... Okay. That's not my problem. What syndicate are you talking about? The only one that matters around here. Oh, okay. The Sayoka Syndicate. Okay. They pretty much run the city. And that being said, rumor has it that Emmett Goodman is on the outs, so they might not miss him much if he were to disappear. Now, okay, let's see if I can talk to the loan shark. But I just want the... I want information. I swear it on my best set of wrenches. All right. Goodman's holed up in one of the warehouses on Epside. All right. Place is locked up tight. But there's a guard who watches the door, and he's got the key. I'll stay with Billy in case Goodman's men come to collect. They're not stupid enough to tangle with me. All right. So you got some muscle around here. Excellent. I guess I'm going this way. Pardon me. All right. And elevator. So I'm going to try to convince this syndicate guy... Billy Clinton saw the stolen ship, but he's being threatened by a loan shark. I agreed to solve Billy's problem in exchange. Oh, I'm gonna have to pay. I'm gonna have to pay money. I know it. I know it. I know it. It's not gonna go good. I'm gonna get in trouble. Shooting up the town. Whoa. Like um, Stargate Atlantis. Good, good series, by the way. I have to admit, a TV series based upon a movie that wasn't that great, then to have a spinoff, I did not see that coming at all. No. Whoa. Oh, it's a fantastic series. Yes. Get lost before I oh. make you get lost. All right, sorry. I didn't. I didn't know. I just was, I'm very, very curious. Hey, that's my ship. Hey, cool. Um, oh, all right, here we go. Suppose I'm going the right way. All right, cool. You guys are just citizens. <laughs> All right. All right, let's talk to, uh, this is private property. Yeah, all right. You better keep walking. This is private property. You already said that. Show badge. Ooh, I don't think I want to do that. Let's try to go this route first. Do you now? Um, hang on a sec. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe you got here. Is there not something I can take to help with persuasion? No, no, something helps with persuasion. I guess I don't have any. A complete system purge. Oh, wow. I know I don't want to take that brain. I think it starts with an H. All right, I don't have any. All right, so I might have blown it. 
You'd better keep walking. Uh oh. <sighs> I might have to reload my quick save. Let's try the badge thing. Nah, I don't think so. Neon's got a ranger, and you ain't him. I don't know. Huh. So I, I guess you have to kind of analyze the situation and take the right chems before you go into a situation. That could be expensive and weird. All right, here we go. So I don't have anything to help with persuasion. It's just. So if I go to social, I have that. I can't upgrade it until I have three successful challenges. All right. Here we go. You lost? Nope. You better keep No, oh, no, we've been here. This is All right, so let's do the persuade. Do you now? All right. Uh, I'm sure we can work something out. Let's go that one. I hear you. You go in, talk to the man, and then you come right back out. Try anything stupid, and it's your funeral. This will get you in. Oh. Well, well, thanks. <laughs> okay. Not impressed. I pressure canister. I'm out of here. Ah, uh, wait. Hey, back the hell off. Oh. Why does everyone have to be so rude? They don't like my uniform. Maybe it's the ball cap. I don't know. Oh, hi. Ooh. What? Got a problem? No, but I like your gun. I probably shouldn't have said that out loud. Gotta learn to keep my inner monologue. Oh. And you are... A new customer, perhaps? Well, now, always happy to have a visitor. Tell me, what brings you by, friend? Little light on credits, are you? He's like a southern accent. Uh, show badge. I'm here about the debt you're trying to collect from Bill Clayton. Uh, show badge. Your days of praying on desperate people over, or what kind of operation you're running here? Oh, jeez. All right, fine. Let's ask. Oh, it's just a modest enterprise, really. You could call me an importer, an exporter. Inherited the trade from my daddy. But I'm sure you ain't here about my business. <sighs> All right, let's try the first one. Uh, it's awful kind of you to intervene on my behalf. But I think I have the matter well in hand. Thank you all the same for your concern. Billy can't pay the debt and you know it. So let's let this one go. Billy doesn't owe you a thing. The debt was his brother's. <sighs> yeah, let's go that route. Well, that's where you're wrong. Uh oh, Cal agreed to my terms, including collection from family on the event of his passing. Uh -oh. It ain't my fault he dragged Billy into it. But make no mistake, that's exactly what he did. What's your stake in this anyway? I need information for Billy, so I'm helping him out. That's none of your business. Ugh. The idea of putting some fear in in a scumbag like you sounded like fun. But see, I'm I'm a rookie. I can't get um what did the marshal say? Cavalier? So Well, I'm afraid that's just none of my concern. Oh, here we go. Leave Billy alone, or you'll make me deal with. No, no, no. Or you'll have me to deal with, sorry. No, we're gonna try this first. Then offer me something I want, and I'll consider it. All right, come on, Billy's barely getting by as it is. Back this kid into a corner and you might make him dangerous. The Rangers can make your life. No, not here at Neon, that ain't gonna work sure we can work something out i'm glad you understand the position all right I'm good good here. um 
Do this for me and I'll owe you one. No. You're wasting your time. Billy hasn't got the money. If you help me, the free rangers might hold a... If you don't help me. Oh. Oh. Huh. Now we're going to go with this. You got something. And something's better than nothing. Dang it. Uh, you'd have my gratitude. No, I don't want to owe this scumbag anything. Getting on the ranger's bad side could come back and haunt you. Uh, hang on one sec. That's, that's my only option. This is not going to go well. I know it is. Hang on. Seems to me Dang like it. you're a long way from Aquila City. You come walking in here drunk on your newfound authority, uh -oh. thinking I'm some small time crook you can push around. Yes. Maybe it's time I show you how we resolve oh, no, disagreements no, 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 no. here in Neon. Oh, jeez. Crud. What you think was gonna happen? I don't know. Oh, here they come. Hang on. Hey, what? I wasn't done with you yet. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Holy smokes! Walk out that door and everyone's gonna shoot at me. And if I unlock this, I'm probably gonna get in trouble. So I'm not gonna do that. We're just gonna check out anything local here. Oh, I can't take anything. Ah, oh, okay. Oh. Right. So nothing from the syndicate, even though they're crooked. Oh, they're probably connected. I get it. Yeah. All right. There's a guy at the door. I wonder if I'm gonna have to deal with him. Sheesh. Now, how did that update my mission? Talk to Billy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, it's true. I got that gun. Quick. Oh. All right, let's uh, let's compare here. Um, hey guys, Linux Guru Gamers here. Check out the link. Ooh, playing a little Kerbal too. Nice. All right, so I I have been using. the boosted maelstrom and there's a modified oh that's a um okay so he had just a regular maelstrom i i get it all right so he had a, a regular coachman i've got an anti-personnel coachman all right all right well it's a, a little healing here put the weapon away so we don't look that suspicious and uh, I tried to talk to him everything looks fine there's no shootout oh okay there's some people running 
New mod for the inventory list? Um, no, it's still a star UI. They updated it. I think the only mod I added was um, uh, an auto backup for the executable. So as you probably know, or may not know, a lot of Bethesda games, when, um, when you run something that needs a script extender, you have to use, uh, or, or if you have a mod that needs a script extender, you launch the game from the script extender versus the normal executable. It still launches a normal executable, but it opens up all the hooks for, uh, for the modders. If the executable gets updated, the script extender breaks and you have to wait until they update the script extender and any of your mods that rely on that version of the script extender. The auto backup allows you that when, you, when the executable gets updated, it backs up your old executable. So that way you can actually copy it back over and play until they update the script extender and all that kind of stuff. So it's kind of a, you know, a helpful thing. No. <laughs> so everything I talked about the script extender in the new mod, you didn't hear Linux. Sorry. Am I going the right way? I'd be making a fortune if they let us finish I went the wrong way. Oh, okay. All right, good. No problem. Wait, I didn't actually come this way though. What are you guys looking at? Yeah, so I, I added, uh, updated um, the mods, the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the default graphics, the LUTs, L-U-T's. Um, I found one that does a little bit better. They have like vanilla plus enhanced and stuff like that. And I, I like the higher contrast are better for my old eyeballs uh, and the auto backup. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bad part of town, buddy. I'm gonna do you a favor. Head back to Bayou Plaza before the disciples do. Uh, okay. Thanks. Oh. I think I can handle myself. Hey. Your ass, not mine on the line. Shush. Whole area's got to hell. All right. Us crate rats used to think the ebbside strikers were awful, with all the muggings and shakedowns, but now that they're on the ropes, kind of wish they weren't just holed up in Madame Sauvage's. Streets are getting bad. Real bad. <sighs> all right. Um. It's good to know. Sure. Sure. So, for being so helpful, a chance for a donation. Come on, might be saving my life. What with the disciples and all. I have a heart. Oh, uh, why is everything a thousand credits? Hey, thanks. Look, I mean it. Go back to the plaza. Ain't nothing but shit and misery. All right, so, for some reason, I have to come this way, so thanks for the help. Catherine Lucian keeps demanding we look into her husband's murder. Murder. Yeah, right. Hysterical old broad. So, neon, yes, has lots of neon, but it's like the 
cornerstone of just a bunch of side quests. All right, here we are, finally. Any time now? They hit the bars, buy a lot of drinks. Did you talk to Goodman? Oh, yeah. With my gun. Uh, I took care of it. You don't need to know how. Solved the little problem. There we go. Well, have you got any proof? Oh. When a ranger says they're gonna do something, thanks, Jace. They do it. Now start talking. Okay. Time for me to keep my end of the bargain. There you go. The woman you're looking for is named Grace Early. Yeah. Stealing ships is her line of work. Okay. She usually comes here to sell the goods. Rumor has it she just finished a job for some mercenary outfit. That's the one. She's been throwing money around, so must have paid well. It did. I know her. When she isn't out on a job, she's a regular at Madame Sauvage's. Okay, I have something else I have That's to go there too. That's on the too. upper platform. I'll back you up. Oh, sweet. All right. So wait a minute. There's two things I have to go with Madame whatever. Is that Catherine? Let's probably. All right. All right. Let's go do this. Let's go. Oh, yeah, I would not have thought about going this way. Oh, it's right here. Found it. You're in the right place, baby. <laughs> Stuff or not. Oh, geez. I don't want to hear about it. All right, let's go right to the. Uh... There's my backup. There he is. All right, here we go. Oh, great. A free star ranger and his. What are you? A sidekick or something? Yes, sure. I am free star ranger deputy Clark Griswold. <laughs> I love that name. Um. Well, I'm sure your mom is real proud. She is. So how come I'm talking to the sidekick instead of the ranger? Get her. This is the deputy's case. Is that so? Yes. And you had to bring backup just for little old me? Oh, she's sassy. <laughs> I'm flattered. Anyway, this ain't my first interrogation, so let's just get on with it. Oh, oh so you've, uh, okay. Uh, please, I just need information. It could save lives. Mm -hmm. There's no need to make this difficult. You're in trouble, Grace. You'd better start talking seriously. No, no, no. You've had run-ins with the law before. Seems a little too personal, but no, no. We're going to go the, uh, I'm the new spanking new deputy route here. Aw, oh, ain't you polite. It's not working. I'm guessing this is the part where you tell me that you've got questions and that you expect me to answer them. Wow. That sound about right? Yeah. You jacked a ship from Hope Tech. Don't bother denying it. Uh, I know you stole a ship, but people might be in danger. I need your help. Don't play games. No, no. We're going to do this. All right. So I jacked a ship. It was just a little fun. I didn't even keep it. It was a job. I turned it over to some men, and they took off for who knows where. End of story. Nothing I did put anyone in danger, okay? That's where you're wrong. They were mercenaries who threatened a woman to get her farm. You provided means for mercenaries to intimidate and threaten an innocent person. Look, they didn't tell me what they were gonna do. How was I supposed to know they were gonna go after some farmer? You should have asked when you took the contract. Yeah. If that woman had been killed, you'd be an accessory to murder. Yeah. Did you think about that? I... Ooh, we got her no, on the ropes. I, I guess I didn't. Oh, uh, still time to make this right. I'm going to go down. Oh, no, no. I need this. Let's see. It's not that simple. Oh, okay. Um, I know you're going to tell me eventually. I don't know. Let's go this route. There's no reason for us to have a problem. Is there? Yeah, I hope so. Now you're getting somewhere. Hey, dang hey, it. Don't get ahead of yourself. I'm glad you understand the position I'm in here.
Nobody will ever know you told me, I promise. No, I Dang it. can't. Sorry. I give you my word. I guess if I can't trust a free star ranger, then I can't trust anyone. Yay. Right? I was approached by a woman named Maya Cruz. Yeah? Said she was a senior member of the first and that she had a job for me. She was working with someone inside Hope Tech uh -oh. and pitched me on the idea of jacking a ship right out of the factory. Okay. We were deep into planning the job when she had some kind of medical emergency. Ooh. She said she needed surgery and would be in recovery for a long time. Interesting. That was a few weeks ago. I haven't heard from her since. So, um, did she say, whoa, 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 whoa. Why would you agree to such a risky job? No, did Maya say why the first needed the Hope Tech ship? Only some kind of offhanded comment about their client wanting to expand the operation ahead of schedule. Uh, In my line of work, you learn not to ask a lot of questions. Mm -hmm. It tends to make people uncomfortable. All right. Did she say what she's being treated for? No, but it sounded serious. Okay. She was upset. Seemed kind of shaken, you know? Didn't seem right I should pry, so I didn't. Go on. Not long after that, I got a message from a guy named Marco. Marco. He said he was the money man for the first, and he offered half up front. Never met him directly, though. It was always through intermediaries and using encrypted slates. Okay. I had the feeling he was paranoid as hell. Do you have one of those encrypted slates on you right now? Yeah. Here, take it. I'm done with all this. Anything else you want to know? Uh, I think you're done here. Did anyone in the first give you a way to contact them? No. All right. Nothing at all. All right. Left me feeling a little disappointed, given how well they paid me. All right. Did he ever give you a location? Not so much as a hint. I'll tell you. He's as cagey a fixer as I've ever met. Bankroll in the first must take a lot of money. I'm sure he's got all kinds of side hustles going on. All right. Nothing, really. I was told when and where to meet them. They paid me what I was owed, and that was it. All right. Appreciate your cooperation. Yeah. Whoppers. Sure. Next time you're at The Rock, you should give that encrypted slate to Ranger Alex Shadid. All right. He's got a gift for cryptography. Ooh. If anyone can crack that slate, it'll be him. All right. I'm going to head back. Good luck, Deputy. Thanks. Then I'm free to go. Yes. You're free. Thanks for your help. If you promise your ship checking days are over, then yeah, you're free to go. Suits me. I'm getting too old for this line of work. Besides, I'm going out on a high note. Oh. Ain't many can say they grabbed a ship right out of Hope Deck. Should make a good story for the kids one day. All right. It looks like I'm going back to Aquila. And, uh. What's up? Hopefully, this I encrypted something or other is going to give me. Yep, that's where we're going. Talk to Alex. All right, I got some stuff to sell first. Right, let's go here. Sell weapons that I'm not using, like that Grindle. Those two Maelstroms. Oh, all right, never mind. Um, he's broke. So that means we're going. You know, all three of you guys are dressed exactly the same. Just saying. I used to be an actuary. Yeah. All right, let's um take a look around. I get all kinds in here. How about I just show you instead of tell you? Thanks. Okay, so weapons. Sell. No, no, I want to sell. There we go. Weapons. Sell that. 
Now that's a suppressed maelstrom and I have a boosted. So that does less damage, less DPS too. All right, well, unfortunately you can't take the mods off and use them like in Fallout 4. Uh, all right, we'll sell it. I'm gonna get rid of that coachman. And so let's see if he has any 7.55. No, all right, but I'm gonna buy Any. All right, what else do I got to sell? I got one space. Oh, I hit the wrong button. I'm going to sell all the food. Okay. Thanks. See you later. Oh, did a 360 on him. Yeah, I need to go to the rock, talk to Alex about the slate. Pardon me, come through. Where am I gonna find Alex at? It's gonna be upstairs. Looks like it. Hey, deputy. Hi, Elga. Excuse me. Welcome to the rock, I guess. Thanks. Hey, it's Emma. And a year or two back, I shared a drink with Ron Hope. That man can drink. Okay. <laughs> I don't think I wanted to know that, but okie dokie. Hey, you're doing a real good job. I don't know if anyone's ever told you that. It's really an honor to be able to help out. All right. Thanks. Talking about me or just the probably all of the rangers? That that's probably what she's talking about. Hey, it's Alex. Might be hard work, but it sure beats living under the poop. Yeah, it sure is. Look who it is. Well, hey, Alex. Hey, I wondered when you might come by. I'm Alex. Hey, Alex. Nia's report said you were heading for Neon. I've always wanted to go there. What did you think? Um, what's stopping you from traveling to Neon? Oh, I can't fly anywhere. Issues with my Eustachian tubes. Being in a pressurized environment is like someone taking a laser cutter to the sides of my head. It's not great, but at least I can pretend to visit the party capital of the galaxy by having you tell me about it. Um, it's not my kind of place. I don't really care for it. It's true. I, I, I it's not really my kind of place. No, too any light. Yeah, I bet. It just sounds so exciting and so. Stimulating. I had to shoot people. Probably makes Aquila City look like the more boring backwater town in the settled systems by comparison. Boring is good. Alas, I'll have to experience it vicariously through you and the other rangers. Alrighty. So how'd it go? Turn up anything useful? Yes, yes, I got a tablet. Ooh, here. Uh, I need your help with this encryption. Ranger Price says you can crack this. I want this slate unlocked as soon as possible. No, no, let's say another ranger referred. Did he now? Yes. Well, in that case, challenge accepted. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before I know every dirty little secret stored in this thing. Now, if you get any more of these, bring them to me. Oh. It helps if I can compare different instances. You gotta of the do cipher. Days. Okay. All right. Just look for me up here. I will. I have no life, so <laughs> I'm not usually hard to find. Oh, this is cool. Um. Uh, okay. Have fun with that. Oh, I will. I guarantee it. Now I gotta go talk to the boss. Boss boss wants to see me. He's upstairs. Just like all the other corporate bigwigs. Hey! You look really busy. Let's talk for a minute. Okay. Welcome back. Any luck finding out who stole that ship from Hope Tech? Uh, I was able to track down the thief with Ranger Price's help. I did. She was a shipjacker named Grace Early. Yeah, but I, I did all the work. Now, I'm gonna, let's do this. Grace Early? Yeah, I've heard the name once or twice. Oh. 
Sounds like you're making real progress. I am. Thanks. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Now, thank me when I've taken down the first. Uh oh. Yeah, let's do that. Good. Stay focused on the task at hand and don't take your eye off the target. That's how a ranger should think. What did you learn from this starship thief? Oh, there we go. I scored big time. Got the names of two high ranking first member, M Maya Cruz and Marco. Uh, the first has the money, has a money man called Marco. It's also saying, okay, let's go with that one. Now we're getting somewhere. Yep. Sounds like you've got a couple of new leads to follow up on. I have a guess who Marco might be. Really? I served with Maya Cruz. She's a technical genius and an expert hacker. Oh. I could give you some background if you want it, or we can go straight to planning your next move. Um, yeah, let's have some info. They said she was a child prodigy, which probably explains her arrogance. All right. Even so, she was fiercely loyal to Major Holt. I don't think she'd ever give him up. Who's Major Holt? If you find her, don't expect her to cooperate. All right. You think you know who Marco is? There was a mech driver in the 1st Cavalry named Marco Graziani. He came from money. When the first Cav got a reputation as the top unit, he transferred in. Rumor was that bribes made it happen. Marco had a knack for getting hold of anything we needed. There was talk, the family fortune came from smuggling, and I believe it. Oh. He had this dream to become a wealthy businessman when he got out. But I guess that got put on hold when they locked him up. They locked him up? All right, well. Like what? Uh, Marco's keeping his location secret. Where can I find him? How can Around I Around the time he got out of jail, we started hearing Marco's name in circulation. Word is he's heading up a smuggling racket. Based on what you've learned, I presume he's funneling his ill-gotten gains to the first. Ranger Autumn McMillan is out at Red Mile right now looking into the smuggling operation. I suggest you pool your resources. All right. Uh, just remember, that's outside Freestar Collective Space. Oh. So we've got no jurisdiction there. So use my gun. All right. Where would someone go for long-term medical care? Because Maya, yes. Most likely place would be the clinic. It's in Freestar Collective Space and provides the best medical services credits can buy. They also guarantee privacy. So it's an ideal place for someone trying to keep a low profile. All right. Ranger Ben Armistead is posted there. I'll send him an update on the situation. Okay. It's enough to go on. Your priority is to gather more intel about the first. What are they planning? Who are they working for? Where are they headquartered? I'm going after Marco. Just remember that your targets were locked up because they were loyal to their unit. They think the Freestar Collective betrayed them. Oh. In other words, you ain't going to get a warm welcome. So be careful. All right. Good hunting, deputy. Thank you. Appreciate that very much. I, I really do. Um, go to the Red Mile. So I need to find... There's another am, uh, gun place in town here. So I need to find it. Uh... I want to see if they sell anything for my, uh... My six shooter here. Um, what are the chances that if I go to the map, uh, it doesn't give you like street level. No, nope. so I got to find this place on my own. Go to the entrance and turn left. All right. Well, that's, uh, you mean Shepherds? There's a, another place. There's supposed to be another gun manufacturing or something like that. Because he didn't have any 6.5. Uh, oh, Roland's. Oh, I got you. I got you. So I'm looking for. Looking for 7.5 millimeter. 
If you're sure, Laredo makes some good gun. Laredo, that's the place. You started shooting up the town with something. Oh, well, she's got something called white out. Hang on. I don't remember what. 7.5 millimeter. I don't do payment plans or I'm sure I got what you need. See, that's not going to work. That's for a different receiver. So I need to find this, um, oh, behind the bar, okay. I didn't even know where the bar was. You mean inside the rock? Chunks. Museum. So you want to come here for a half day? Where well, the entrance turn left? I, that's what I thought I did. Left of the settlement. Oh. So here? Sorry. Okay. Let's all just take a breath here. We all want to protect people from the ash. Left of the settlement. We're on the same side here. So they're outside of the settlement. Oh, okay. Akil is the settlement is what you're saying on the other side of the main drag. Okay. I'm I'm totally at a loss here. I don't know uh Oh All right Then turn right. Okay. Oh, is that the pub? Oh, 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 I didn't know that. Trade authority. I heard Mr. Wright's gonna be looking Oh, I'm, would you guys quit talking so loud? There it is. All right, cool. Thank you. Might want to steer clear of the stretch. Lots of crime over there. So we had to clean up the graffiti on the range again. Why don't we just close it down? It's not like it gets much use. I need some place to put the prototypes through their paces. It stays. But you know, stretch trash will come back and loiter. Or worse. Let them. A few beer bottles and graffiti is the least we owe them. Yes, Miss Lance. So he's from, I've already talked to him. He's kind of a jerk. Every gun gets a full Laredo guarantee. Okay, your weapons are made in the city? Indeed. As a matter of fact, they're made in this very building. You're standing in the storefront of the Laredo Firearms Factory. Oh, okay. I designed and manufactured every firearm for sale here. As such, I can offer you my personal assurance they're of the highest quality. Uh, you're the owner of the whole company. Why are you working here? No, no, no. Yes, of course. And I forgot what I was looking for now. Head Ranger. Sniper. The Prime. <gasps> Ooh, is that better than what I got? It uses, wait a minute, hang on. So it's got better range. It's more accurate. Got a recon scope. I, I, I'm not gonna use it as a penetrate. Oh, I, I have penetrator rounds, I have velocity. Same fire rate though. 
Um, so 7.5 millimeter. So you sell the wideouts. I don't have a, I think that requires a different receiver. Let's go check it out. If I go to this, modify the dead eye magazine. Most powerful casing. See, I don't didn't say standard rounds. Standard chemically tipped rounds that burn out. Penetrator rounds. Go through multiple. Completed uranium. Armor piercing. All right, well, I'm just going to have to uh, have to figure this whole thing out. All right, well. I think you'll find that we carry fine weapons of all kinds here. Got ammo for that. Got ammo for that. Yes, I'm okay. So, let's go out. Do the mission from here. No, I'm doing go the red mile. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Oh, you there? All right, so let's go here. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Oh. All right, no problem. There we go. Answer questions. So helpful. All right. Who's up? First question. Is being a ship captain non-stop thrills and excitement like living in that movie Return of the Interceptor? Um the movie about me would be even more exciting. No, no. Uh there's danger, but there's no glamour like in the movies. Probably the dumbest question I've ever been asked. No, let's say that. Oh, I was kind of hoping there would be thrills all over the place. Nope. I am sure the <laughs> captain is really busy and may not have time for all your questions. If you can afford your very own ship, you must be super well off. You single? <laughs> oh dear lord. It's not my ship. Uh, maintaining a ship is pricey. Certainly, I get by. Uh, I don't see how any of this is your business. Let's just say life has been very good to me. <laughs> Articulate and wealthy. Intriguing. Last question. Let Space is a lawless mess. If you could make the damn politicians fix one thing about it, what would it be? Oh. 
not to get questions from tourists security needs a far higher budget to keep everyone safe the problem is a lot of space is unaligned so there's no one responsible for it Ooh. not really a person to ask that um i'm just gonna say you're talking taxes don't i pay enough taxes hey don't, don't cut that thank you captain for the uh welcome break i got a question is it true captains have someone in every port no you know, that's an old navy thing someone for l'amour whoa or, you don't have to answer that <laughs> um except juicier uh it's been nice to meet you all really oh that's all everyone settle back in your seat so there's two ships out there that one and something else floating around you have the patience of a saint this tour group is very energetic here's some credits for giving them oh yay authentic experience yay this is your captain speaking we're about to head to our next destination remember we'll be in neon in five days so don't spend all your money yet astral lounge here i come dear lord okay wait a minute where'd that so those ships aren't really here that's weird it looked like they were all right well all right i'm landing on the planet red mile That's a really big couple of guns. I think those are guns. Infamous gambling den. Oh. Oh. Yikes. Let me guess. I'm going to go here and... Uh, yeah. Oh, that's right. There's a ranger here. That's right. That's right. There's a ranger here. All right, um, guys, I'm going to take uh, a little bio break here. So let me uh, do that. And let me do this and then do that and then go over here. And get this set up and I'll be back in a little bit.
let's uh, get on with our investigation here at the Red Mile. Hey, Flip, how you doing? Do, 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 Okay, game won't pop up again. Let's lock our mouse, and here we go. Um, I guess we can just exit our ship. Wait, I see, I see a bad guy, I think. All right, so I actually, I need to put my suit on. Otherwise, I think I'm gonna be in trouble when I go out there. Put that on. There we go. Now we can exit the ship. All right. Oh, all right. So I thought that guy was going to shoot me. Oh, stream cold. I don't get paid to be nice. I get paid to put down any vermin that tries to start something here. All right. Good to know, I guess. So it's very cold. Need to get inside. Uh, maybe here. So I've got security. I have a feeling I'm gonna get in a fight with these security guys. Whoa. Whoa, there's a situation right there. All right, hang on. think we'd notice that you tried to slip away without paying your check i was just going out for some fresh air i, I even told the bartender you can ask her yourself fresh air huh on a planet with no atmosphere uh. that's enough stalker lower your weapon we don't shoot guests over a misunderstanding sir please return to your table it's bad practice to leave our establishment without paying your bill first if you need some fresh air, pay up, go outside, and come back in and start a new check when you're ready. I'm sorry, but I didn't think it would be a problem. You were wrong. Dead wrong. That's enough. I think the gentleman understands. Now let's all go back inside, shall we? And Stalker, you and I are going to talk about this later. I can't wait. <laughs> That is a nice... I'm in charge of security here, so I'm the last person you want to piss off. Okay. Can you believe that? Like I'm going to run off without paying. The hell kind of scum do they think I am? Oh, uh -oh. One that might have peed their pants a little bit, I guess. I don't know. What the hell are you looking at? Nothing. Trying to piss me off. No, gosh, everyone's just on high alert here. What is this? A leaderboard. Oh, for for uh, gambling. Oh, all right. Fame and fortune await in the Red Mile. If you have what it takes. Uh, uh, pardon me. Pardon me. Where am I going? Oh, hey, it's a ranger. Back off. Dude, uh, lady, check. Wait a minute. Judging by the wide-eyed and clueless look on your face, I'm guessing you're the new deputy. Wow. Wow. Uh, what's your problem? We'll find out, won't we? Well, your timing couldn't be worse. I've spent weeks trying to crack this smuggling ring, and I'm about to take a very important meeting. Sorry to bother you, but I've got a job to do. Don't worry about me, I can handle myself. Lose the attitude, we're working together. Why are you assuming I'll be a burden? Because I've trained new recruits before, and it's not an experience I want to repeat. Uh, you haven't, you're not training me, lady. Yep. At least you've got a little backbone. I don't have time to catch you up, so you're gonna have to follow my lead. All right. I'm about to meet with a contact who might be able to give me vital information about the smuggling ring. Smuggling ring. If you play your cards right and don't do anything stupid, she might be able to help you find Marco. If Check. you're ready, my contact is here and waiting. All right. Let's go meet your contact. Follow me. 
really loud in here. In fact, hang on a sec. Can I, uh, settings, audio, music's down. Mm. Howdy. Howdy. If you're looking to register, you'll need to speak to Ms. Devine. Oh, you said you'd be alone. Yeah, well, things changed. Take a seat. All right. It can get rowdy in here sometimes, but we try to keep... Who are you? I'm Deputy Clark Griswold. I'm a good friend of Autumn. She was thrilled to see me. Wait, Autumn has friends? Like hell. The deputy here is interested in meeting Marco to talk uh -oh. about that mercenary company he's been funding. Since part of that money is coming from his smuggling operation, we're working together. So you're investigating the first? Why? Uh-oh. Every hunter needs prey. It's a ranger's duty to protect the people, and they're a threat. Yeah, they're trying to take land from a farmer. I want to know why. Mm, seems like a strange thing for a mercenary company to be doing. He's right. I guess an introduction is in order. Thanks. Like Marco, Jade here is the head of a small smuggling cartel. Difference is her crew stays out of Freestar Collective space, while Marco's group operates exclusively within it. Except now he's looking to expand his operation. And he started moving in on my territory. Uh, turf war. Uh, help me find him and bring him to justice. Tell me where he is so I can take the bastard out. Why do you stay out of the space? Uh, it'd be a shame if Marco put you out of business, wouldn't it? Ooh. If you think this gives you some kind of leverage, you're wrong. Sure, he might slow me down for a while, but a little competition won't break me. All right. That's exactly what this meeting is about. Oh. Look, the bad news is Marco's incredibly paranoid. He never stays in one place for long. The good news is I know how to find him. But you're not going to tell us yet because you want something. I want the same thing you do. I want Marco out of the picture. But like I said, getting a meeting with him can be damn near impossible. One of the few people who can arrange such a meeting is right here at Red Mile. Really? Hey, Divine. We've suspected for some time that Red Mile was a meeting place for smugglers. If she's in business with Marco, she won't give him up easily. <sighs> um. All right, what do you know about me, Divine? She's the owner and manager here. I knew that. Inherited the place when her husband was killed. Bummer. Um. What do you think we should do? I'm not asking. Hey, hey, Fluffy, how you doing? Um, all right, let's see. My thinking exactly. I can tell you right now what she's gonna want because it's the same thing she always wants. She wants runners. It's how she makes most of her money. Of course, people that hard-blooded aren't easy to find. Yeah, well, I'm not going out on the mile. That's a death sentence. There has to be another way. You've been a ranger long enough that too many people know your face and your name. Runners attract a lot of attention. If someone recognizes you and tips off May, this whole thing is shot. You, on the other hand, are just a deputy. It's pretty unlikely that a lot of people know you. Sounds like undercover work. You don't have to do this. We'll find another way to get to Marco. No, I'll do it. No, there's no time. Hell, I'm up for it. All right. It's your call to make. Thanks. If it's really as simple as asking May Divine for a meeting with Marco, then I guess that's all you need to do. We'll wait here for you. Try not to die, will you? Hey, thanks. You're really going to take on the mile, huh? Uh. Oh, I don't want to do that. Oh, no, jeez. Trying to get up. There we go. Please be careful out there. I will. Um, where's she at? Over there? Who is there? There she is. Alright, hang on. I'm gonna have her get up here out of the loud music. I took this job so I could 
Ah, a new face. I wonder, is this the face of a brave runner here to challenge the Red Mile? Or simply one seeking a respite? Yes, yes, Red Mile life. challenge. My name is May, and I'm the proprietor of this establishment, home of the famous Red Mile. I assume you're familiar. Uh, Red Mile, never heard of it. Never heard of it? Nope. Never heard of it? No! I don't even ask how that's possible. <laughs> you're in for a treat then. The Red Mile is the settled system's most exciting sporting event. All right. Brave contestants from all corners of the galaxy come here to try their luck in a deadly race to the finish. Those that survive are celebrated as champions. Those that don't are quickly forgotten. All right. <clears throat> I'm happy to answer any other questions you might have. In the meantime, please enjoy our world's famous hospitality. No, no, I got questions for you. Um, what's involved in the running mile? Well, it's quite simple, really. Once you register with me, we'll have a little pomp and circumstance before sending you on your way out the big red door. Then it's a race to the buzzer at the other end of the course. You'll deal with obstacles and deadly creatures alike, while people up here place bets on how far you'll get. Make it back alive, and you'll stand to win riches and the admiration of your fans. I'm sure you can figure out what happens. I'll die. Uh, pomp and circumstance, like a little ceremony? Just a little introduction we do to get the fans all worked up. The Red Mile is a spectator sport, after all. Okay. Most people don't complete the course, so this is a way to give those unfortunate souls a proper send-off while they can still appreciate it. All right. All right. Uh... Of course. And if you're thinking of running, just let me know. I'll do it. I'll be glad to sign you. I think if I do it, it'll impress her and then, uh... Huh. How do I register for the mile? I don't want to do that yet. Things are going smoothly, I trust. How do I register for the mile? Call on me if you need anything. Is that... All right, so I, I have to ask her that question directly. All right, fine. All are welcome at the... That is true. But Mr. Graziani values his privacy. What is your business with him? Exactly. Oh. Um... Gonna be one or three. I'm gonna do that one. It's no small favor that you're asking. But yes, I can arrange such a meeting. Oh! It's been too long since we've had proper entertainment. If you're willing to provide it, I knew it. I'll give you Marco. All right, all right. Are you prepared to run the red mile? Whatever, red, blue, you name it. Uh, if that's what it takes, I'll do it, fine, but. Better keep up your, your end of the bargain. I give you my word, which is something I never do like. All right. Once you've begun, I'll collect bets from my patrons who will place wagers on your Yeah, 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 okay. I'll definitely be coming back alive. And I bet on myself. No, I'm not doing it. That's what every runner says. Really? Now that we're clear on what's expected of you, are you ready to begin? Yes, I'm ready. Good. Come with me and I'll introduce you. All right. Uh, on the stage. No. It's really loud. Test the red mile! 
Oh, so I don't compete against other people. Now is your chance to get a good look at our fearless challenger as you contemplate your wages. Do you see the fire in those eyes? What is that if not steel and determination? I need a drink I after this. you agree that we're in for quite a show. I think I stocked up on bullets. Go through the door and take the elevator down to where the mile begins. All right. Activate the beacon at the base of the tower to see in the distance. Once you've done so, return here alive and your run will be complete. Go now, runner, and see if you can survive the mile. All right. See you later. All right, so ammo, little ammo, little ammo, got ammo, we got ammo. Good luck. Oh, wait, wait, something happened weird. All right, there we go. All right, who's Donovan? It was okay. Ooh. All right, last chance. Weapons workbench. All right, let's see if I can do any modifications here to uh, long barrel, laser sight, reflex optics, muzzle. No, I, can't, I don't have any skills to modify. All right. I guess it's gonna be really cold out here. You have gained an affliction. Really? All right, so I have frostbite. Okay, all right, so hang on. Um, aid. I have three of those. I just took it. Oh. All right. Holy crap, this thing's tough. Why won't my gun reload? Son of a beeswax. Oh, I forgot I had this. That didn't go off very well. grenades hang on hold please oh i got frag mines. ouch that hurt me too jeez hitting all the wrong keys
Oh. All right. I don't know what the heck's going on with my weapon. This is going to be tougher than I thought. Like the shotgun is the most effective. Do I have any other weapons? No. What is it? Squall? <sighs> There's a persuasion thing. There, that's what I was looking for. America. Whoa, it jumps. need more ballistic damage I can't do more ballistic damage oh no uh um medicine oh okay yeah I'm going oh I got a I got a spring too I didn't notice that
Oh, there's two of them. Do I have another squall? Oh, I don't. Um. Oh, I'm surrounded. I know. Sucks. I'm about out of ammo on this thing. Cupcakes and confettis. Alright, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm running for it. I'm confused. Where am I supposed to go? Running for it. I go to return alive. Dude, run. Is there something that helps me move faster? I thought I saw something in there. Movement speed. Yes, please. Son of a gun. I think so. This doesn't look familiar. Oh yeah, it does. Never mind. Dude, I almost shot you. Am I going to the right place?
Speaking of pleasure today. Whether you have to gamble, participate, or just the, the Red Mile has entertainment for everyone. Congratulations, oh. runner. You have succeeded where most have failed. Saw that. Who's up? In fact, you seem none the worse for wear. I'm out of bullets. Uh, I did what you asked. Now it's your turn. It was a cakewalk. Just between you and me, it was not. I'm not easily impressed, but you've managed to surprise me. As promised, I'll set up your meeting with Marco. I'll dispatch a courier to let him know you're coming. All right. Please take a moment to relax and enjoy our hospitality. I'll return shortly. Uh, I got work to do. I got to I got to take something cuz I got a broken leg or something. Hang on. So, I got a spring acute. I got joint pain. <laughs> Yeah, I'd say so. All right, I'm all fixed. I hope you. I hear you're one well, of the runners to watch. Uh. All right, never mind. You made it. Must be tougher than you. You're back. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it was nothing I couldn't handle. Better than ever. It was fun. And here I was feeling like a nervous wreck the whole time. <laughs> hey, long fellow. Guess I had nothing to worry about. Anyway, I'm relieved you made it through okay. Why? Afraid you'd lose all that work you put into your smuggling investigation? I wouldn't expect you to understand. All you see in people is what you can get from them. I'm glad because that was an incredibly brave thing you did. And we need rangers with that kind of courage. Also, I... Yeah, I owe you an you apology. An attitude. I was pretty awful to you at first. Uh, yeah, you were. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, whatever. Uh, yeah. You're right. Let's focus on the job. Yes, work. Once you're on your way, I'll return to the rock and let the marshal know what's going on. Come home safe, deputy. That's an order. You always were the soft one, little sister. I'll go to hell. Or at least make yourself useful and get us some drinks. All right, now I gotta to talk to me again. I'm not doing that run again. Basket, People talking about this one. Hi. I don't know. Well done. Well, hello. Time for me to keep my promise, runner? Yeah. You can find Marco on Kodos aboard his ship. I'd advise you not to keep him waiting. He is not exactly patient. Then, uh, um, what else can you tell me about him? What did your message say about me? Only that someone wanted a meeting. All right. Don't expect to catch him unprepared. He keeps a sizable force of mercenaries aboard his ship as bodyguards. All right. He's intelligent, well-connected, and utterly ruthless. He's also a man of taste who appreciates the finer things. You'll find out soon enough what I mean. Well connected as in like with the governors or something like that. All right, then I'll be heading. Good. Travel safely, runner. Should you ever crave the challenge of the mile again, it will be here waiting for you. Yeah, I don't think so. What is your I need favorite bullets. waffle? I need to go somewhere where I can buy some bullets because most of my bullets are gone. And I'm lost. I went the wrong way. Yep, sorry, sorry. Oh, hey, Stoker. Hey, watch out. You cause trouble, and I will not hesitate to end you in any number of ways I see fit. This ain't the United Colonies, Cupcake. Here, you listen to me. I lead the security force. Sir, yes, sir. Why are you so hostile? Because we have to deal with the dregs of society like you. Oh, I don't... Because May lets us handle things. Put your lights way. out. Best way to keep people in line is through fear. No. After you see your first head split open on the bar floor, you're gonna think twice about skipping out on your tag. I didn't buy anything. Maybe you don't start that fight over your lost bet. You get it now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, sure. All right. Now get out of my face. Iron underwear. Yeah, that's gonna make anyone's 
feel uncomfortable. What is this thing? Look at that. You still got all your limbs. Of course I do. All right. I need to go. Before I go directly there, I need to take stock of my stuff. Best way to do that is in the protection of my little ship. I went through a lot of pharmaceuticals. There we go. I don't want to tell her that I want to run the red mile. Why would I do that? No, I don't want to do that. Um, go to Kodos. So I actually, first of all, okay, we got we got ammo here, none there. Got ammo there. I was so we got ammo. We can go. Not a big deal. Um, let me uh. Do this and do this and then transfer. All right. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Sorry. All right. About to shoot my gut, my seat. All right, uh, so can I just go to Kodos? Okay, looks like I got to go here and then there. There we go. Been here. Wait a minute, Cheyenne? Isn't that where Aquila is? I think it is. Well, right. I guess we're landing right here. Board Marco's ship. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's gonna be one of those big firefights. I know it is. I have bullets, but do I have med packs? Oh, it's a secret rendezvous with pretty flowers. All right, so. Check my aid. Med packs. I have two med packs. Great. Tell you what's kind of refreshing is not having a companion yammering in my ear all the time. But also, what's kind of a bummer is they usually shoot things too. So. Oh, sorry, you have no med packs. I got a wicked paper cut and over the overreact. I use them all. <laughs> In front, Marco. Oh, nice music. <laughs> okay. Wow, this is a big ship. You're lucky to get a meeting with Marco. Am I? No, really. Am I? 
I don't know which way to go. What's... Oh, he's got laser turrets too. Laser. All right. Ah, the dulcet tones of classical piano. Yes, you get it. All right, here we go. All right, Marco, how the heck are you doing? My name's Clark Griswold, and I'm not here to- Welcome. Oh. May's message didn't exactly make it clear why you wanted to meet with me. If you're looking for work, my organization is always in need of pilots and security personnel willing to take risks. Oh, um. Have you moved into the new house? Yeah, yeah, well, we've been in the new house for coming up on almost a month now. Uh, almost everything's out of the boxes. You know, it's usually, we don't have any, anything hanging on the walls yet. Um, our first focus was getting in, getting acclimated, figuring out some things here and there. Um, we, we did the whole minimalist thing and moving. So where we moved from, we left pretty much Choosing the, the big carefully. furniture, the big dresser and, and, and uh, chest of drawers. We're gonna sell that. We're gonna find something or build something that fits our needs here. Um, kitchen is working out great. Um, living room with the TV sitting on a couple of chairs. So we still have a lot of things that, you know, we can get by with until we recover a little bit and then move forward. Uh, my main focus was I got new chores now. I got lawns to mow and to edge and trim and all that kind of stuff. Um, and I'm trying to get the garage to be more palatable. So this week and weekend, I have to prep to put the last two sheets Let's of sheetrock up. Along, but before we? I can do that, I want to put some electrical outlets because the wall has got no power. So I have to drill some holes, run some wire, and in talking with an electrician, uh, I'm just going to daisy chain to uh, three receptacles for a 20 amp fuse and uh, yeah, go that route. And then, um, so what we're going to do is drill the holes. I'm going to put uh, protectors over where the wires are. And then when we put up the sheetrock, we'll just poke little holes and put the, put the wires through. And then that way I can go through and put the boxes and all that kind of stuff. So. Then once I get that up, then the, the garage will fall into a little bit more organization. So what should I do? Your organization. Oh man, he just fell right in. Yes, he did. In fact, he's over there asleep right now. You've heard of the first, I take it. I'm not just a member. I also helped to fund the outfit through a network of independent traders. Of course, illicit goods are the most lucrative, so. There is a constant need for skilled pilots. He, um, for the last, I'd say 13 years, there was a room that had food, water, and his litter box. And that's where he would get, you know, we'd close a door and he had, you know, it was a big room, but now he doesn't get locked up. He's got full reign of the house and he's a real good cat because when he's for, he doesn't meow unless you get up in the morning and you don't feed him. Then he meows at you. And then once he gets fed, he's fine. He's a very even keeled, fun 14 year old cat. All right, so show your badge. I got some questions about the first. Uh, I'm here to, I'm not here to work for you. I'm here to stop Something you. Something on your mind? All right, your days of threatening innocent farmers are over. Mm. All right, let's do this. Ah, I see. You did well to find me. I'm not an easy man to locate. Though I suppose we haven't exactly been keeping a low profile lately. Given the nature of the contract, the degree of exposure was always a risk, but a calculated one. To be honest, I think the Major is all but spoiling for a confrontation with the Rangers. Still, I confess, I'm a little disappointed that the Marshal sent the deputy instead of a full-fledged ranger. Oh, those are fighting words, dude. Uh, why would the Major want a confrontation? To settle accounts. Major Hull served with distinction during the Colony War. But the leaders of the Free Star Collective 
they turn on him. In his eyes, the Rangers are enforcers for a corrupt council of governors. Really? That makes you his enemy. As for me, I didn't see any profit in nursing that grudge. I prefer to focus on the future. No, actually, Pookie doesn't really hop up on anything, uh, except for the couch. The one thing he does that he never did before is uh, he, access, he has access to a windowsill, like in the living room, and he loves going behind the curtain and, and looking out. You know, he's like, uh, you know, hey, what's going on? You know, so he never had that before. Um, I want more details about the first operation, including who hired you. I'm going to bring down the first, and that means you, Marco. You mentioned the major. Is that who runs the first? That's right. Major Hall spent 20 years in lockup nursing a grudge against the Freestyle all right. Collective. We all did. A lot of good men and women died for nothing because of those cowards you work for. You've chosen your side, and I've chosen mine. Now, he, um... The one thing that we haven't figured out is that if he eats too fast, he'll... He'll get sick. So we... We try to not let him gorge himself. He won't do it, but... You know, he, before um, Alex and I, his food and water bowl was between us over at the old place. Uh, it's in the kitchen now. Um, so we're not around him. So he has this, uh, he's got this thing to where I'm only gonna eat if people are around me. So if you walk into the kitchen where his food bowl is, he'll run in there and st start eating because that's how it's been most of his life, I guess. All right, I want details. What? <laughs> I'm not sure you are grasping the situation here, deputy. You are on my ship, outnumbered by my guards, who will kill you without hesitation. I'm a businessman. If you expect me to cooperate, I'm going to want something in return. I won't tell you everything. I do still have some loyalty to my unit. However, I can point you in the right direction, in exchange. I want the Rangers to let me operate with a free Oh, hand. this ain't gonna happen. Nope. Um, no deals. Tell me what I want to know or face the consequences. I have a better idea. Instead, I tell you something you don't want to know. But you should. All right. The Council of Governors is a group of greedy and corrupt liars who are using you and the other Rangers to protect their own interests. Oh, no, oh, no. Do you really think they give a damn about the people of the Free Star Collective? I, I don't care. I don't care. No more stalling, Marco. Either talk straight or you get shot. Your choice. I'm not going, I'm not doing this for them. I'm doing the protecting of some people. Yep. Oh, I've already made it. Oh, I don't get no bullets in that one. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Let me die. Oh. Well, that didn't go very well, did it? <laughs> I didn't realize he had a turret right above. Dang it. All right, so we know how this is going to go. You the runner? Boss is Alright. Pardon me, come through. Who even wants to listen? What level turrets are these? Oh, they're they're small turrets. Hmm, I can deal with that. Oh. Oops. Wrong way. I gotta speed through this conversation. Alright, we'll do a now, what level is that one? That one's also a level one. All right. Welcome. If you're looking for work, my. Uh. Ah. You did well to. Oh, I suppose. Given the nature of the. To be honest. Still. To settle accounts. So I don't know if in the game that if you maintain the same conversation, it me. keeps track of that. <laughs> All right. You are on my ship. Yep. I'm a businessman. I won't tell you. No. Nope. However. No. Nope. No deals. I have a better idea. The council of government. Yeah, I know you Do you me. really think?
Whatever road brought you. Oh. Why am I in? I'm gonna die again. All of a sudden I went to scan mode. All right, so we're gonna do this. That's right, I'm kinda cheating here. Set up my own mind. How is that possible? Do a quick save. I know. Welcome. If you're looking for what? Uh, I have a feeling if I'm just going to do this, I'm here. No, not to work for you. No. Uh. What the hell? Dude, reload your gun. That went a little bit better. Oh, geez. They're throwing grenades at me. Ooh. All right, hang on. Uh, it's a regular Equinox. Oh, here we go. This will be helpful. Um, recalibrate for current, protect current user. Thank you. A dagger. Oh, the turrets should be shooting it all down. All right, that's fine. Oh, those worked out nicely. Oh. Still a bunch of bad guys out there. Nice music though. some things behind me. Are they the turret? Oh, wait.
know, I, uh, I was given an ultimatum. I didn't take it. Come on. All right. Actually, I hope that works out. Okay, I got the encrypted slate. That's what's important, I guess. Oh, I said restroom. What would a mess? the alarm where are they so the only thing left are okay so there's something over huh. so it's gotta be a camera or something there's four things I'm not going to worry about it. Someone keeps throwing the lever. Oh, well. We got Marco. Wait, can I steal the ship? I mean, it's a ship, right? Huh. So, there's no cockpit? I would love to steal this ship. I mean, as a non Freestar citizen, you know. <clears throat> so I'm thinking there's a computer terminal or something to that keeps going off it's not these guys doing it nothing there huh Uh 
right, let's see if that holds now. No security cameras. This is bedroom. Looking to see. Calibrated Kraken. Cards. Cameras. Yeah, we got a few people stuck in the uh, wrong places here. Oh, I never went behind his bar. Oh, he's got a... Oh, I can't use this computer. An intercom. Oh, I can drink wine for persuasion. I didn't know that. Then this was for the, the turret control. Yep. So that one's better. Oh, it's got a tactical battery. Oh, I've got a tactical battery. Oh, never mind. I'll sell it. Still have to find ammo for that. Wow, nice tools. I don't know what that's for. So, no cockpit that I know of, that I can get access to. Nope. So, it's a, a ship with no place to pilot it. There's a lot of pretty bird noises in piano. Unless the restroom has a super secret access, sterilize your hands. Okay. Huh. All right, can't steal it. I tried. Is there a second entrance outside? I'll take a look, but I didn't see one. I just think it's a... Uh, a base of operations, extreme solar radiation. Maybe a hatch. I'm thinking this, it's not a stealable ship. seems like it should be I mean there's the docking mechanism right there and it's got weapons There's a pilot seat right there, a hatch. So there's a ladder somewhere. Huh. Well, I'm gonna pop in one more time and see if I can see a ladder. But I'll be honest with you, I would think that there would be another hostile person for me to kill because, you know, pilot might not. Oh, 
Oh, wait a minute. How do I get in there? Ah, security. No. <gasps> oh, that's just their door. I thought that was a hatch up. I was going to go, yes. Oh, that's just how their doors open and close. Kind of cool, to be honest with you. No, I think we're going to come up Bupkis here. Nah. Oh, well. It was worth a try. I need to go and offload some of the stuff I've got. Oh, grass just popped in. All right, let's go up. Let's go drop off any resources I'm walking around with. Couple. And um, I did, I did my level up, right? I think I took more, yeah, healing. All right, I've got a few more resources. Let's see if I can do a little bit more research. Uh, performance enhancement, why not? Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to uh, start tracking this stuff. Like, like this. Tracking R. Now that tracks all three. Is there a way to track just one? I guess not. I can't hover my mouse over and just, or is it like control? No, oh, all right. Guess not. All right. Really concerned. Maybe the robots. They'll need robots, I think, for when I do a base. Hey, robots too. All right. Not bad. Um, how's my inventory? I got stuff to sell. Did I pick up any suits? I did not. Oh, I actually didn't pick up that many weapons either. All right. Um, so I guess. We just take off, eh? Ship. Hello, I don't Captain. We pose no threat here. Quite the opposite. Our ship's full of the faithful, Sanctum Universum. Happy to talk if you're inclined. Oh, no, no. We're safe travel, stranger. Thank you. All right. Um. Give the encrypted slate back. Talk to Davis. That's a clinic. All right. Let's, um. I want to do the mantis. Yeah. Oh, 
was a bump. Now, the one thing I wish is like whatever active mission you were on, I wish I would put it at the top of the list. It doesn't. Oh, I wonder if there is a, maybe on the mission list, there's a, a, a tab for like active or something. Or current. Over now. Dang it. I don't want to talk to you, Chief. At the right planet? I think we are. Yes, we are. Secret outpost. All right. All right, guys, I'm going to take a quick bio break. I will be, you know, right back as soon as I get you guys all squared away on this. Just click a couple buttons and do this and that, and this, and there we go.
All righty, I'm back. You're 100% cheating. That's not, that's not a good thing to admit, you know. All right, let's lock my mouse. Land. Here we go. Back to space camp. Now, wait a minute, there's something behind us. Oh, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute, hang on a sec. I saw something else. Oh well. Modified calibrated Grindel laser sight. Nah, I just want the ammo. Someone trying to sneak around on me? There you are. Take this. Death from above. Now, hang on a sec. I'm I'm a little confused about something here. Could have swore that when I was landing behind me, I saw something. Is there anything else on this planet? Oh, there is. There's a, an unknown there, and that's a cave of some kind. Ooh, there's more stuff here to check out. I can't remember. I'll, I'll have to give him a call. Uh oh. Oh, I'm out of med packs. Oh, that's not good. I can't be so cavalier. Pookie's staring at me. It means he wants food. So do I have anything that will heal? Heal pace that treats stuff. Oh, there's... Th oh. Fine. I want to get my health back. Oh, and I want grenades instead of frag mines. There we go. Oh, that guy's a big fella. Instant meal.
Oh, uh, I didn't know that. <laughs> That's funny. All right. I'm going to have to go in this a little bit more calculated. I'm eating all the food. I don't know if it's really helping, but. I don't have anything that helps. Nope. Wait a minute, didn't I? Where's all the communications go? Magazine, so here. Something about, I read that there was this thing. Calling all spacers. You know who you are. Because that's what they call us, isn't it? The ones in charge. The ones who never respected us. The Free Star Collective, the United Colonies. Even the Crimson Fleet and the Clintic. They see us as the leftovers. The unaligned space scum running rampant across the middle. Down. You know what? Uh, uh, Maybe they're right. But so what? We matter just as much as they do. We deserve Whoa. just as much as they do. A lot of you have been all over. You've seen the empty building. Ouch! Factory. They're out there, lots of them, abandoned after the colony war. And those others, they want them. They're taking them and everything inside. Are you gonna let them do that? You gonna let them get away with that? I'm not. I want my fair share. And I don't know about you, but I'm ready to take it. Oh, med pack. Whoo, I feel better. All right, there was a communication. Something. There it is. There was, um, layer slate, gold mine. Trap. Okay. All right. You're doing well, Leon. Almost there. 
I know. Things have been difficult. The mantle of the Mantis is a heavy burden. Sure. But you can do so much good. The spacers and pirates need someone to fear. Someone to check them. To make them realize some lines cannot be crossed. You have it in you, Leon. I know you do. Stay sharp. Focused. Just a little further. So I met with a lawyer and was prepared to party. Hard. The video will was... emotional. Mom and I stopped talking years ago. Mom... didn't look good. But it was Mom. As weird, crazy, and cryptic as ever. I'm almost surprised she remembered she even had a son. It was... hard to hear. Almost touching. But then the punchline. No inheritance until I go to Mom's secret base on Denabola 1B. And she ends up with an I love you or an I'm proud of you. No. Six Semper Tyrannus. Oh my god. Always with that stupid Latin saying. Over and over she'd say that damn thing. Thanks, Mom. Thanks oh so much. Let's see. Oh, it's too difficult. Fine. How do you know what? Oh, that's my overall health. Okay. There we go. That's one way to take him out. They're having a good old day. Oh, there might have been two of them. Nice. We got six grenades. Oh. Jerks. Maybe you got to gonna come up here? No? Did you just call me an a-hole? Oh, jeez. Pack blew up on him. down there. Come on, don't make don't make this hard on yourself. Popped him in the noggin. There too.
I wonder if you can drop a grenade then shoot it after lowering someone. Oh, uh, that would be better to do a mine item up here. Oh, jeez. Am I not going? There we go. There we go. Diet. I see food and I eat it. <laughs> <laughs> he run away or is he coming up this? Oh, jeez. Yep. I was not prepared. He's got a ballistic weapon too. Cool. tough SOB. Found Leon's body. Looks like one of those darn traps got him. Big fight. All right. Anti-ballistic refined star something or other. What's oh, a space helmet? Let's see. So, uh, better, better, better. That's better. That's not better. That's better. It weighs more. And uh, minus fifty percent incoming physical damage from ranged weapons. Ooh, I think I'm gonna wear it. All right. Now, um, how many med packs do I have? I have two total. I don't have any incendiary on this playthrough. How you doing, Electro? I heard 
with this one. Pirates from going off the deep end. I... I guess it's possible. She never talked about where she got her fortune. And man, she could handle herself anywhere. It's... a, a lot to take in. Dang it. Oh, uh, like, like if you, uh, if you get the ability to class B, you're wondering if, oh, I got you. Dang it. All right. That ain't working out too well. Take that. Take that. This is where this guy came up here and I blew him up. Okay. Oh, it's a window I'm shooting. No wonder. Dang it. Oh. Um Oh. Here, have that. Now, are you guys going to be dumb enough to follow me up here because that would be awesome. See, I tried to through the shoot through that window before too and that didn't work out so well. So, The one thing I liked in the Fallout series, the, the AI was dumb enough to where you could kite them. These guys like to hide a lot more. This is a, a if I remember correctly, this room is big and it's got a lot of big guys in it too. It's not a good old fashioned gunfight when there's more of them and they got more bullets. Harsh 
Oh! Yay! Take a look at that. Hey, it's Red Munch Gaming. Bill Rocket Jockey, there's a link to click on. Give him a follow. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, I do love a good old fashioned good fight. No, 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 no. No. Oh, it's Leon. Oh. Right, hang on, before we talk to Leon. Bomb has been planted. Yeah, this is, uh, I'm following the, um, the Rangers storyline with this one. Oh, okay. Wait, what? Oh, oh, Leon Live. I got you. I got you. Yeah, I did the the main storyline and the UC faction with um with my first one and now I'm doing I'm going to focus I'm going to try to do base building with this one. That is so happy. Oh, good. Oh, ho, ho, med packs. Yes, sir. Oh, I have needed these things so badly because I did this so badly. <laughs> All right. Um, anything to read? Ooh, ooh, that is a good sniper rifle and let's see here better energy and em resistance now i like mine a little bit better you just need to learn to sleep one hour before each four that's true very true ah uh, okay let's see here um i'm gonna i'm gonna have this replace my energy weapon no, no, my shotgun. Yeah. Okay. There it is. Ooh. All right. I got no bullets for that. Oh, I can't believe I just searched his buttock. All right, um, let's go listen to... That. Oh, it, that's like most of the Bethesda games when you sleep, yeah. All right, so I'm having skill points. All right, so he died. His mom's protege didn't quite make it. Um, wow, I never, I, I can't, I, I learned that in Fallout New Vegas, but I completely forgot to do it because you get so caught up in it, you know? Um, all right, who knows the answer?
Alex, Alex figured it out. She told me, I forgot what it was. Trying to see if she told me in a, uh, in a message here. Oops. Shoot, I am unarmed. Look, we can help each other. I can be useful. Just don't kill me. Livy, and I mean you, uh, no harm. This place was full of traps. Traps everywhere. I removed them. But this, this corridor is just too dangerous. See? Looks normal. One step inside, slam! You are trapped, and nobody's been standing after the doors reopen. No one knew how to get through the corridor, but I figured it out. There are letters on the floor. Yeah. It is a grid. Those letters must spell something, but there are so many words or small phrases. Why does everyone always say that? <laughs> See, I've been helpful. You... you could let me go. Or better, I can help. I know these traps. I know how this mantis thinks. Please, let me help. And you got killed in the firefight the last the time I did inside. this. You can trust me. Spoken like a true spacer. You won't regret this. I'm not a spacer. I will hold back here. And, well, good luck. All right. Uh, optional, learn more about the mass. Explore the... Wait, what? Did I miss something? Oh, just down there. All right. So explore the lair, optional, learn more about the lair. Okay, all right. That's just listening to mom rant, all right. do that. Spelling backwards is not my forte. Oh, that was only... Oh, it's the paint bucket. Oh, I get it. I get it. Okay.
Now, why wouldn't be blood splatter all the way over here? Though somebody threw it. So out of curiosity, what does more damage? The, I'm looking, um, so this does 351. Oh, all right. If I'm gonna have robots chasing me, all I got are frag mines. I'm gonna kill Lively here, whatever his name is. Oh, jeez. Dude, throw it. No, no. Throw it. Thank you. Well, those do some adequate damage. How many med packs do I have left? Search them both. I didn't hear an explosion. Oh, oh, I was supposed to listen to that. I am sorry I could never show this lair to oh, you. Oh, jeez. The lair is a secret that's been passed down for over a hundred years. And there are rules. You remember when you were a teenager? All the training, all the tools to prepare you for this. I know you have it in you. I'm going to die. still standing there. Really? The robot didn't even attack him. That's 
That's horrible. All right. Um. Are you jerk? So. So, you were a jerkwad anyways. Oh. What killed you? What's making that noise? Nothing in this room. Oh, geez. More robots. Those weren't here the last time I played. Talk about random. I got sneeze. Uh, I've never shot the yellow containers. I wonder if they, they're probably good for against humans. I got sneeze. You don't see every day. Free dead. Robot. Oh. I hear talking. this place blind of good stuff not food stuff good stuff I'm not doing a very good job at it about Leon uh, I read this been forced to take lives before it's the first time I did so as the mantis That didn't sound very good. Scorched dirt. All right. Now we're talking. Okay, maybe that's just ambient noise. 
Whoa. Oh, that's cool. Need it for something. All right, hang on. Check it out. Oh, I got you. I see. Fancy computer. glitch oh my god that was weird I'm overweight so out of curiosity let's see here about the same except for that weighs a lot more Oh wow, I didn't know about the the holstered weapons. That's really cool. Did not know that. Now, I've been using that. You can save scum the perks on the mantis. What do you mean? Perks? We're just going to be overweight, that's all. If you reload the game, just because you open the suit cabinet, it re-rolls. Oh, really? Oh, interesting, interesting. I um, I came across a little uh, uh, tidbit on when you're in the lodge, they have a Mark I suit of armor, and you can get an angle on the door and uh, get it to open. And you can get that suit. It's actually a really nice suit, too. There's nothing in here. Oh, I changed outfit, and so it turned off my uh, flashlight. I got it. So you can do uh, an F5, reload the game, and then see which one is the... That's a lot of work, though. You know, I think I have links turned off because I couldn't control them. And I am working on another way of doing it. It's just really slow progress. So, uh, Discord would be better if that's a link. Thanks and sorry. That's trash, right? Now it's got value attached to it. I think the mod I have for interchangeable junk, I installed it wrong or something. in here <laughs> hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, excuse me. Oh, good stretch. Man, I slept really good last night too. Uh, I want to go this way. Hey, hey, Mantis ship, yay. Now, it's got more room. Um... Hey, hey, look at that. Sweet. On the run. That's right, it's got... If I'm not mistaken, it's got really cool display, but there's no real storage up here. Yeah, so you can put stuff. Oh, I'll take it. You can put stuff, but if you change the ship, the stuff uh, just goes into random. Um, not a fan of the coachman. Well, I, I say that now, but the coachman did help in the red run mile thingy, so. Oops, I went the wrong way. Inventory R and then resources and then T. Yay, lighten the load quite a bit. Nice. Where's the ships or the. Oh, the captain doesn't have a, a thing here? Oh, I thought he did. That's a cargo hold. Jump seat. Oh, there it is. Captain Clark. That's what I was looking for. Tomato. Oh, I'll be taking that med pack, sir. All right. Oh. See, I don't really represent like a, a ranger with the mantis suit on either, so. By the way, Electra, that was a good tip that if you've been somewhere, it might be out of your jump range, but you can still get there. I, um, I appreciate that tip. I know how, I actually don't want the Mantis as my home ship, so I'm gonna go fix that right now. I don't forget. Talk to the guy in here, I think. Yep, there he is. Got anything you need to offload? Trade Authority is always. Hey, what can I do for you? Wanna... Okay, no problem. Okay, no problem. And that's my current home ship, but I would like to go back to this. There we go. And I should move my cargo over. All right. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for today. Appreciate you guys being along for uh, this uh, chapter of being a ranger. I'm, I'm doing okay, but uh, we'll see, right? So let's roll some credits here. Credit music, credit music. Oh, this is the credit music. 
guys thanks for the new follows appreciate it all right i'll be back tomorrow with some more starfield you guys have a good one red we'll see you later